a lot of places won't care. Some people individually may care. They might have implicit biases. So if you're worried about it, then go ahead, wear a wig, as long as your wig doesn't look bad. <laughs> but I personally wouldn't care. But I mean, again, it's 2024. Most companies really shouldn't care about that, but you never know. There might be one that you want to work for that does. And uh, so if you're really worried about it, then go ahead and throw on the wig. All right, the next one is, will I be too old to get a junior engineering role? I graduated with a bachelor's in mechanical engineering in 2021 at the age of 21. Due to the times back then, I then I took the first job I got out of school, which was in commodities training. That's kind of fun. Fast forward to this year, I decided I wanted to get back into engineering, and I got an admit into a funded one year's master's program to a top 100 university. My living costs are covered by my parents. When I graduate, I'll be 25. I'm just wondering if I screwed up by taking this master's since I'll be old by the time I graduate and if my age will prevent me from getting any junior or trainee roles. Any advice? I'll still have a degree by the end of it, so it's not a net loss, but ideally I would like to get into a test engineer role. I'd hate to go back into commodities after getting a master's in engineering and having to also have to answer in interviews why I got the master's for what wasn't good enough to get an engineering role. I'm so lost. Any advice would be a great help. Yeah, so I don't think you'll be too old to get a junior engineering role. I think that you might be disappointed by the salaries that are available to you. 